needed to get going. So bear with me just one moment longer because this is important. You need a buddy. Someone who will help you hold you accountable. Now I do this with all my clients, but you don't have to employ a coach or a mentor for this. A good, reliable friend or family member. Share your journey with them. Ask them to help you hold you accountable. Heck, get them to sign up and do the program together. I know that it helps an enormous amount to work with a buddy on this. My wife Annie is my buddy. She helps me nag me when I need nagging. She helps me to celebrate when we need to celebrate. And those days when I feel as though something is going off on a tangent, or things don't quite work out the way they're supposed to, she fails to remind me. And motivate me and say whatever needs to be said. So get a buddy. It will help you develop this habit of achieving your own success. Use the workbook template to the right of this video to consider your buddy choice and how you will get them involved. In this simple exercise, I'd like you to consider who would be a good buddy to choose to involve. I found that working with a buddy helps you to be more accountable for forging your success. Your partner should expect to give you about three hours of their time to help you go through the whole process. And ideally, you'll get together in the same room so that they can pick up on all the visual clues and body language. Video or telephone can work, but it's not ideal. So who can make a good buddy for this? You want to choose someone with whom you are comfortable opening up to. You might want to work with a friend or a colleague, but I don't recommend working with a sibling or a spouse or a parent. Sometimes these people are so close to us that it clouds their objectivity. Very often, casual relationships often work best. Someone who you trust, but does not perhaps know you intimately. Whoever you ask, they need to be a good listener. Someone who won't tell you the answer, but will help you find it. Ask someone who has a genuine curiosity and a desire to help. What's more important is that you can be honest and uncensored throughout the process. Consider these attributes. Someone who you know and trust, but not so close, who will be willing to give you their time, is a good listener, and has a genuine curiosity and desire to help. In the workbook, Make a list of those people and any notes about them to help you. When you submit this, I'll send you a PDF by email with a little guide to share with your prospective buddies and an email template that you can edit and add to your personal touch. Invite them and send or pass the PDF guide to them. This is filled with tips on how they can best help you in this process.